Hello and we're back in Legacy of Cain, Soul Reaver 2. In front of this edifice. Mm. Yes, it was interesting, last conversation. I don't know if I've mentioned it yet, but the earring that Cain has is actually Vorador's ring from Blood Omen. Yeah, because we've got to see quite a lot in that cutscene. Made of teeth, looks like a razor. It's basically a ring with a razor on it. I'm mm. assuming you used to use it to uh, trim the necks of people. So to speak. We have we could look around here and then yes it was pointing us to the left. But that doesn't mean we can't look around first. Interesting water effect. There's all these uh, little weird islands. They have stairs on them. Like do they used to At least to, that one does. I think you just stood on some as well when you came on here. Yeah, so I said at least that one does. Right. And then that one. I wasn't talking about that one. Right. But this one also has them. Yeah. This used to be some larger structure. I don't think you can get in. It's not light it up some at all. Divot. No, not really. Just a platform, one yeah. of these dealies. Which I'm assuming we'll do something with it at some point. Oh, absolutely. Seen a couple of them. That's not really high enough to get it there. No. Let's try. Someone can just run around the bottom, right? Right. As I was going to say, I think this one here you could uh, shoot yourself onto in the cold war rail. Nom 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 nom. Well, doesn't look like there's much of interest here, actually. Lovely. No. Maybe it's like you were saying in the previous episode that it's areas where they were going to do more with it and then didn't. Oh, it disappeared when it got close. No, well, there's certainly nothing on the bottom, at least anyway. I think we'll just get out of here. Let's uh, find the nearest way out. Well, that staircase there looks like you could almost reach it. Yeah. Can I turn and look around? Yeah, I'm just thinking, I can't see. Is that one? No, that's a forge. I think it's back the way on the platform behind us where we were Must talking right. to Kane. But we should go over there when we're corporeal again. Right, where should I go? Turn the, like, jump onto this one in the middle that you're facing. And there's that one on the right that's fairly level with the water. I think you could just like swim and then shoot back up onto it. Probably, yeah. And then yeah, there's something up there. It's a font of darkness by the looks of it. I'm not convinced you can get to that. Mm, actually, I possibly can if I just go this way. Unless that's what that's for later. Just sort of leap up. Yeah, probably. I think it's just over there, where it's sort of directing us in the cutscene. Yeah, there's, there's actually... Not much to do. Not much to do. Oh well. It's like you want to go behind that rock to your left, I think. There's like a platform with the light on that you can get on. This one over here? Yeah. No, what is it? It's me, Mario. Cool. And I think you just go around to the next bit. Yeah. Oh, oh can you reach above it? There you go. 
King of the world. <laughs> Actually, you can kind of see that a bit clearer. Mm. I kind of wish there was a zoom. Okay, then. It's ever onward. Very important to fight these guys. Oh, it hasn't forced us to. Oh, it's forcing us to. Ow! That's hot stuff. See, it's funny because he was on fire. Well, yes, he was, he was Yeah, I get you then. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Totally worth it. That looks like another jumpy bit. Yeah, the wall climbing bits kind of blend in a bit more with this texture. Hmm. So you just pass them, yeah. Oh, there's, there's hey, doesn't a thing. say I have to fight them. There's a thing over the oh. door, yeah, exactly. Oh, wait. Wait, there's a thing over the door. There's a thing over the door. They're going to attack you. Okay. <laughs> I didn't realise there was an eyeball over the door. Oh, right, right. I thought you meant there was a field over the door. I, I meant there was a field over the door. A coruscating field. They're the best kind. Mm. So yes, this time no, we no, actually no, no. do unfortunately need to, to kill these guys because there's soul reavers on either side of that doorway up there. I don't know if you noticed. <laughs> Oh, you are much easier to kill with an aroused reaver, so to speak. If you'll pardon the English. There we go. Get the souls. I'm not sure Fast? he's going to let me. Yeah, I think he's just chasing you, chasing you, chasing you. What if I do the old switcheroo? Oops, the old... The, the old... <laughs> The old switch. No, You're can not, I not get you up can't there? jump high enough to make that. I can jump high enough. That's just just how there was an overhang. Got it. But there was the old switcheroo. Right, let's be having you. Anyone else want some? Do you want some? Do you want a little? For some reason I'm ash? All the souls. You ain't, you're not bite-sized yet. There we go. Nom 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 nom. Nom nom nom. <sighs> okay, after all that. There was a lot of nom in there, that's uh get back to being, uh, well, nominal, I suppose, would be the, uh... So there was a font back there as well. Yeah, I didn't see that. The evil eye. It is a font of darkness, I believe. Yeah, because you blind it, you see. Right. Although, really, it would make just as much sense to blind it with light, right? It would. Just Wait, where did you guys come just from? Just run away. No, because they're going to get in my way when I try and, um, blind the door and go through. <laughs> Oh. It seemed to spawn them behind you. <clears throat> yeah. There you go. I discovered here were unambiguous. This race of winged beings, the architects of the pillars and the creators of the Reaver, were Nosgoth's first vampires. Their bloodthirst appeared to be a curse inflicted upon them by their vanquished enemies. These images confirmed the truths that Cain had divulged to me, but I 
had been too incredulous to accept. I struggled in vain to see how the pieces fit together, how Cain intended to escape the dilemma of his destiny, and what role he had plotted for me, and why Mobius and the dark powers with which he seemed to be allied were so desperate to see Cain dead, and so intent on me being the instrument of his execution. Because it is a bit odd. That's cool though, and we look like we are in another tomb. Well, we are a Tomb Raider. Yeah, I do feel like there's more Tomb Raider vibes from this game, which is interesting. Cool looking. Are there any more? Or? Well, I suppose I get to look around quite a bit. Oh. Ah. Oh, it's a bit like the t the ceiling on the time stream in place. Totally get up there. It might be something we make a like a dark bridge to. Well, there's a, there only seems to be a mural in that corner, but there are sort of spaces in the others, which is interesting. Yeah. Which way did we come in? In here, we came in that way, and the door shut behind us. That's a reaver door. Yeah. Oh, we can even hear the rain from outside. Okay, so there really seems to be one progression from here, but it, well, obviously there's two sides we'll of it. Up, yeah. It looks interesting enough. More reaver iconography, etc. Sunlight. Oh, there's a light thing there. I was going to say we only have darkness. Where's the light thing? Turn around. Which way? Left. 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 Stop. Stop. I think you just missed it when you were sort of panning. It's the one down there too. Oh, they're both light. Oh, I thought one might be light and one might be dark. <laughs> So you don't have the same issue? It looks like it's already lit up. Yeah. Should just use that one. <laughs> I assume whichever one you went to first would have done this. Do you sort of point and shoot from oh, good point. there? Yeah. You probably do. That looks cool. It does. That was interesting. Hmm. <sighs> <sighs> yeah, what I did is I um I went up to the edge and then pressed duck and it didn't register and it just made me jump down. So I was gonna do a, a long jump like yeah. that just to make sure I made it. Okay, I'm still curious about the left and the right, but it might be somewhere we come out of instead of going into... What do you mean the left and the right? There's holes. Like, there's a corridor there in that section. That's where the murals are, isn't it? No, left. Look left. Or there's a corridor, and then there's one on the opposite side. Or are they just lights? I thought they were corridors. I'm assuming we have to go incorporeal though. Yeah! Which means we lose the light blade. Actually, where are we? We're oh. at Forge. That helps. 
A little bit of a spoiler, I guess. Huh, yeah. Well, you can sort of tell, I mean, if you look at... If you look at the murals on the wall... Those, I take it. Yeah. Right. So now we know that's the air symbol, I suppose. Okay. I mean, I need that anyway, you know. Oh, it's right in front of me as well. <laughs> Whoa! Ooh. Maybe I should look the other way. Ah, uh, it does look quite cool as well. We'll probably come back out because you always have to leave the, the temple pretty much the same way. Yeah. Some strange like symbols or gems. And Same gems we saw earlier. Fonts. Right, do I suspect those are just the same ones? They seem like Let's, they um, be, uh... Find a oh there's one. Yeah. Oh. It's That's fine. We <laughs> can go back to the beginning and look around. Yes, yeah, so those like gems turn red when you're corporeal. Cool, cool. And we have some fonts here as well. Are they not activated? Or are they for air for later? Yeah, you can tell from the symbol on Right. There. Cool. Good colours here though. I like the, uh, mm. the red light gems. I have no idea. I don't, I don't know. Oh, they'll just take one heck of a killing. Like I say, I, I always thought that the weapons felt a little nerfed. Oh well, yeah. Feels like it's sort of forcing you to use the lever. Okay. It really wound up to that one, didn't it? Move, yeah. They go away once you get rid of the guy with the disc. We've done one of those before. So we've got a light snake head, a dark snake head, I think yeah. the snake heads, and then we've got this windy pops in the middle here. A couple of bits and pieces around, yeah. Bit of a calm and angry face. Font there. Uh, right. Specifically an air font. I'm assuming it mostly wants us to go down. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. I did want to have the, the circle of actually. It's like a head slash snake in the middle. It's like the hood. And then that well, kind of looks Anubis shaped. I think it's like a open snake mouth. Ah, yes, quite probably. So I'm standing in the snake head. When you have the air power though. Okay, let's uh, drift down. Oh, there's like a little try area try for it? So, Let's try yeah. for it. It looks like you can climb up once you get to the bottom anyway. 
Yeah, they've all got climbing walls. And there's a down with a forge. Let's try going down here. We need to have power of darkness. And we don't have any sort of reaver colour at the moment. I quite like the way you can see almost through the door. Yeah, it's not quite shut it's tight. Cool. And I'm well, assuming case, one of them is the power of light and one of them is just the power of the regular reaver, which I believe, yeah, yeah it's this I'm one. I'm wondering if I can just get to the regular one. Oh, they're down there, I saw a font. I did also see that symbol there on the top left of the screen, which is, of course, the uh, other, other world. So that'll be the other reaver, right? In fact, are they even... Yeah, it even tells you all the things. Oh, I'm just going to go down then. I figured you'd do the one that doesn't have an alignment first. I am, I just wanted to see it. And I'm ignoring that spirit guardian. I'll come back for him. So yes, we should be able to get through here. Really? We should be able to get through here. Rude. <laughs> Behind door number one. Yeah, I have to say, you just want to get the guy with the thing. Dance for me. You need short work of them. Yeah. Let's not bother using anything but the Reaver. Which is a bit of a shame, because, well, actually the other things aren't that interesting anyway. But let's have a look and see what's behind this door. Oh, that door made noise. The other one we used to learn just kind of opened silently, it was a bit odd. Is that a, you come back later when you have the power? I'm not sure, maybe. Yeah, looks like it. Opened the way, which was still useful. What? What? Do you have to do them in a, a, the correct order? It just shut behind us because it shuts behind us, I think. You can do the light one as well if it wants you to. Yes, there appears to be a down and an up. Okay, well a down and a down and a down. There are three of those, right? So we've got a green one, a red one and a blue one. Let's try the blue one. It's really bizarre. It's cool, but bizarre. It's got a pair of wooden symbol. But this guy. It was like writhing. Actually, still going. Yeah, that's really weird. suspect down each of these we're going to find a similar to blow. Mm. 
because I suspect there's one of each colour and we're going to need to activate them all somehow. Okay. Yes, yeah, very much the same thing. But I don't get another cutscene. I was curious if I would actually. <laughs> So obviously you don't need to do a cutscene for each of them. Actually, while I'm here, does this warp at all if I do this? Oh, so so. In an interesting way. In a not symmetrical way as well, which is quite cool. However, the general shape of it, I think, is the same. Okay, well, I don't think we need to look down the other one as well to see if it's the same thing. No, I think we, we need just, to yeah. transition. I suppose light or dark, what are you going for? What? Stop resetting things. Let's try light first. Oh, we the other way. Okay, we have a similar door as last time. Is it going to jump out at us? Yes. Get back in there. And same mechanic as always. It's a little repetitive if it just keeps giving you more of the same rooms, which is a shame. Well, let's see if this one's any different. So that will create a dark bridge. Interesting little little area, little zone. But I take it there's nothing here you can actually do. Well, I need to be able to do something at some point, otherwise I've got no way of progressing. So yes, I'm assuming I can do something here. However, I think I might have picked the wrong option. Oh, there's a dark font over there. I can't get over there. In fact, right. if I try, I get blown the other way. However, you can only come in here with a light sword, so I don't quite understand how I'd do it differently, unless I can just I do this. And then go over there, maybe? Maybe. I was thinking, oh, you go up another level on this side. Because it looked like maybe you could. Ah, there's the clue. Ah, okay. Guys, guys. Um. <laughs> there are some down there, I think. Yeah. Over, you can see there's another little ledge, and then the sort of the fish texture bit on the far end. And then you have to wait until I kill these. Oh, yeah. Right. I suppose you want to jump back over anyway, I could just show you. You jump over and don't activate the dark thing, go towards the far corner. There's a little ledge you can jump on. Maybe? No, it just looks like you can jump on. That must just be for appearance, though. No, I don't want to transition to that, do I? I want to do this. Because that means I can get over there in the real world. But then I need light, I'm assuming, so... Do I do 
this. And do it real quick, yeah. And then what, do you shoot something over here? Or do you shoot back the other way? Hmm. You shoot into the mouth, that's blowing out. Or do you just jump up and let it carry you across? I don't know. Good point. It might just be to carry you across then, just give yeah, it a go. Yeah, must be. Right, I need to do a taller jump. Okay, right, I know what I'm doing. So we jump down. Here. Come on. There we go. Yes, what's called for, I think, is just the uh, the duck jump thing. Yeah, yeah. Super jump up, however you want to describe it. Sometimes you press the jump a second time and it does nothing. Get my bridge. Change to light. Jump up. Jump up. Duck down. And then... Yep. Excellent. Yes, it's very uh, dark. I can see why you need a, a light reader. Ha, huh, I think that's instructional. Ha <laughs> ha! I like the way it lights up when you do it so you can kind of see the picture, but let's yeah. go for it. Yeah. Yes, the picture's instructional. That's a winged blue being placing something or pulling something out of the chest of a writhing body, like the ones we've already seen. And we can pick it up and we leave a trail of green. How odd. But I think standing here with our green bloody stone is a good place to leave it. We'll see you again next time.